so now we are going to see a sum which is actually similar to 10.31 it is also a six marks question but uh, just a slightly simplified version of this so i'll write this alone so what is given in the sum is f of x is equal to k into e power minus 2x squared plus 4x minus 2 okay so you have to find k nu and sigma squared right so as always before you start doing the sum first write the formula right the probability distribution function from a normal distribution is going to be 1 by sigma root 2 pi e power minus half into x minus nu by sigma the whole squared once you have by hearted this formula please proceed with the sum so as an example 10.31 so if this is the first time you are seeing this video I would suggest please see example 10.31 video before you do this sum right because this sum is not in your textbook but it's asked as an outside question in one of the question papers <clears throat> so you now have to bring e power minus 2x squared plus 4x minus 2 into this form right e power minus half x minus nu by sigma format so let's take the power alone so minus 2x squared plus 4x minus 2 so let's take minus 2 outside you will get x squared minus 2x plus 1 right and this is nothing but minus 2 into x minus 1 the whole squared straightforward this is of the form a minus b the whole squared right which is a squared minus 2ab plus b squared in the place of a we have x in the place of b say we have 1 so this becomes x squared minus 2x plus 1 this is what you have here so that's why i'm writing x minus 1 the whole squared so if you put the power it becomes e power minus 2 into x minus 1 the whole squared but let's see how we can write 2 2 can be written as 4 by 2 right and 4 by 2 can be written as 1 by 2 into 1 by 1 by 2 the whole squared right why we are writing it in this form that's because we want to bring it to e power minus half x minus nu by sigma the whole squared so if you see this will now become this minus 2 here can be written as like this right like this so minus 1 by 2 into already there is an x minus 1 the whole squared here divided by 1 by 2 the whole squared or this I am going to write it as e power minus half into x minus 1 by half the whole squared now this when we equate it to the given formula right given is nothing but k let's write it down k e power minus 2x squared plus 4x minus 2 is equal to 1 by sigma root 2 pi e power minus half into x minus nu by sigma the whole squared right now you know that this can be written like this right so we'll write it as k into e power minus half into x minus 1 by half the whole squared which is equal to 1 by sigma sorry root 2 pi e power minus half x minus nu by sigma the whole squared right so now you equate you can easily find out that nu is equal to 1 sigma is equal to half if sigma is half sigma squared is 1 by 4 and k is can be equated to the remaining part of the equation k is equal to let me write it neatly k is equal to 1 by sigma root 2 pi 
and you know that sigma is nothing but 1 by 2 so this will be 2 by root 2 into pi right or this can be also written as root 2 into root 2 is 2 right so it will be root of 2 by pi so this is the value of k that's it so it's a very simple sum compared to 10 dot 3 1 but otherwise the logic is just the same 6 marks it's all yours